welcome back uh, as uh, we all set to bring you the live broadcast of this finals of the under 19 division 1 uh, girls tournament between Anula Vidyalaya and uh, Ratnavali College Kampaha it's promising to be an exciting uh, contest between the, these two top sides being there amongst the finalists for for the last 5 to 6 years both these schools and has produced so many international stars for Sri Lanka. And these stars are all set uh, to to unleash themselves in this uh, big finals here at the Bloomfield Grounds. The batsman.com bringing you the live pictures. Ratnavali College came into this uh, finals after beating Vadu Central in the in the semi-finals and Anla Vidyale came into this uh, finals by beating uh, Devadraja College in the semi-finals. We had the, the third place match earlier this morning. Devadraja College winning that match quite comfortably. And what will it all leads up to this uh, big finals here at the Bloomfields. And it's all set. The two umpires are set. The, the the two umpires uh, for today's uh, finals, Brian Wimelesen and uh, Nimali Nimali Pereira, officiating this uh, the finals. That's a good-looking shot through the gap. Might run away for a boundary. Uh, as it does, it does go all the way for a boundary. That's a, a good start for Ratnapoli College with the pass slightly wide outside the off stump and uh, easily put away. It's a 30 over game, this uh, finals. So, six overs of power play. The first power play obviously being the first uh, six overs. Then, the next 18 overs would be the second power play. And then the final six overs, the third and the final power play. So, that's how it's uh, planned. Samadhi Netpini bowling the first over. Gentle, medium pace. Vishmi Gunaratna and Hassini Vijay Singha, the two uh, openers for Ratnavali College. So far, five runs in the first two deliveries. Fine leg uh, moving into the deep, so a deep fine leg in position. Only two fielders permitted outside the outside the thirty yard circle in the power play.
asking the question that time. Nothing there from the umpire. Right, so that's the end of the first over. Five runs coming off from it. It's a five without loss. Got to be the uh, the bowler Himasha Khavindi, Khavi Khavindi. Falling a bit too slow outside the off stump. A deep point in position for the uh, for the right hander, and so far this first three deliveries have been been considerably good from. Uh, from Himasha. <laughs> a good shot for a single. Just uh, two runs so far from this over from Himasha Kavindi. Early wicket should be crucial at this stage of the game for uh, for Anla Vidyale. Oh, a, a complete mess up and uh, oh, another mess up from the bowler. Oh, that was a chance. That was 100% a chance to for both the sides, in fact. In fact, for Anla Vidyali especially, that should have been the first wicket. Ola couldn't collect the ball properly. Uh, those are the chances that you have to take. The opportunities are presented. So it's 
should be their job to to collect those opportunities from both the hands but this time poor on the part of the batsman and poor on the part of the bowler as well another a good over comes to an end just uh, three runs from it it's two overs done it's eight without loss
So uh, it looks like we're having a change of bowlers. Probably an injury. <laughs> that last delivery before the incident, the ball came rushing in and uh, struck the hands pretty hard so the ball has been changed Himashi Asara will uh, complete the over Oh, there we go. That's the wicket. That's the first wicket. Hasuni Vichyasinghe trying to go for a big shot. But this time the ball was straight and and it hit the top of the off stump. So the first wicket goes down for uh, Ratnavali Palika Vivyale. As the Hasuni Vichyasinghe will now have to depart for just uh, one run. And now it's eight for the loss of one wicket. Hasan Vijay Singh gone for what is one Imashi, Imalshi Asara being brought uh, to complete the over is struck. Nikesha Kavindi. Oh, that's a good looking shot from Vishpi Gudaratna. Might run away for a boundary. Yeah, he does go all the way for a boundary. That's the second boundary. A toss up delivery from Himasha Kavindi. And uh, Vishpi Gudaratna down on one knee. Played its score of the wicket really well.
quick single there, but uh, good work from the fielder. A quick throw back to the bowler's end. So five runs, uh, in fact six runs from this over so far. With one more delivery to go, Himasha Kavin, the bowling has second over. Oh, was there an edge? With just a single though. And he went full over from Himasha Kavindi. And four overs done. It's uh, 15 for the loss of one wicket. Single there. Igami. Fifteen uh, for the loss of one wicket in four overs now. A good start from Manla Vidyalaya. Tight bowling. Picked up the, the early wicket of the opener. Down the leg side, a wide signal by the umpire. Oh, once again, almost carried it through to the bowler, Nikesh Kavindi, living dangerous loud in the middle. Yeah, so it's all about building a partnership at this stage of the game. They've lost a wicket, another wide by Imal Shiasara. They've lost a wicket already, and they're almost into the fifth over of the match. And uh, what they've got to capitalize here at this stage of the game is is to build that partnership, and to get at least 130, 140 runs on the board because it's not going to be an easy task for the uh, team batting second to uh, chase down the target. So, uh, at Navali College would need to uh, capitalize on getting into that 140 run mark if they can do that. <laughs> well, the odds uh, or the chances of winning this match would be in their favor in these uh, finals.
Oh, that's a good looking shot. It won't go all the way for a boundary, but at least couple on offer. Yeah, that's the kind of shots that you need in this power play. Last ball of this over.
girls tournament 2020-21. We had a small uh, technical difficulty in the first innings, but uh, now it's all sorted out, and uh, we are back to uh, bring you the live pictures of these uh, finals. Well, just to give you an update, Ratnavali College hammered 199 runs in 30 overs for the loss of uh, just four wickets. Beg your pardon for five wickets, 199 for the loss of five wickets in 30 overs. That's a that's a massive target for Anla Vidyale to chase down in these uh, finals. But uh, we'll see whether 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 they would be able to chase this target down. Well, two boundaries on the trot uh, for Anula Vidyale. Well, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale scoring 199 for the loss of five wickets. Vishmi being the top run scorer with a massive century, 125 runs in the finals of just uh, 92 deliveries with two sixes and uh, 15 fours. Worthy performance uh, or contributions from Sandali, 31 of 39. And uh, Vidushika, 16 of uh, 17 deliveries. And with the ball, Imalshi Azara of uh, Anula Vidyale picked up two wickets for 43 runs. So eight runs coming off from the first over, and it's uh, eight without loss. Chasing down a target of 200 runs in 30 overs, it's always going to be a challenge. But uh, but let's let, let's see how uh, things will uh, shape up in the finals. Anla Vidyala obviously being one of the top sides in the tournament, you can expect them to give a good fight. So, uh, uh, what Ratnavali College uh, bowlers should keep in mind is that just because they have 200 runs to defend should not give them sh uh, rather should not give them comfortability out in the middle because Anla Vidyale they are they are a good side and uh, 
There's always going to be a good fight between these two sides. Once again, struck down the ground. He goes all the way for a boundary. Last ball of this over, six runs uh, so far. A good over once again from uh, Fuan Lovidiale. 14 uh, without loss after two overs. So this is a good start for Anla Vidyale. 14, in fact 15 without loss in two overs with uh, Shikari Nuant on 9 and Kaushini Nutyanga on 5. So this is exactly what they need. When it comes to chasing down a target like 200 runs in 30 overs, The batting side would need a proper start and that is exactly what these two batters should focus on at this stage of the game. Not to lose any early wickets, especially in the power play. If they can get the team to at least 60-70 runs for the opening partnership, that will set the perfect platform for the rest of the batsmen to come in and, and to play their natural game and get these uh, innings up and going.
That's the end of your over. A tight over this run from Sandal Vera Singh. Three overs done. It's uh, 17 without losing a wicket. The two umpires uh, for today's uh, finals, Brian Vimala Sena and uh, and Nimali Pereira. Probably sliding down the leg side that time. Umaya Ratnayaka was, uh, was excited for a moment. We have a decent crowd in for these uh, finals from uh, both the sides. Uh, we're seeing the flags being uh, waved at the boundary lines. And perfect weather as well. We're, we had some rain in the morning, but the ground staff was, uh, was outstanding once again, preparing the ground. But uh, since then, we haven't seen any rain and the sunshine pouring in absolute perfect conditions for these finals Oh, oh, confusion. Good early call from the striker. That's wide. Nimali Pereira extending her arms. Just two runs so far from this over from Maya Ratnaika. A good one from him, from her. The required run rate, almost seven runs per over. They should keep that in the mind as well. Oh, good ball. A very good delivery to end that over. So four overs done. It's... Uh, 19 without loss.
Kaushini Nutyanga, one of the top run scorers uh, for Anla Vidya. And I asked him the question that time, but nothing there from the umpire, Brian Vimalasena. Coming in as the opener and now Kaushini Nutyanga and uh, scoring those uh, runs for Anla Vidyale, that is exactly what she's, she's tasked with in this finals as well. So if she can get going and uh, set this team to a, to a proper start, to a proper platform with the bat then uh, definitely the rest of the ba rest of the batters can come in and and contribute to get this uh, Anla Vidyal innings well and past beyond the 200 runs that they need to win this finals 20 runs on the board 4.2 overs Sandalavira Singer Now once again, Sandali Veer Singh asking the question but nothing from the umpire. And that's the end of the over. Five overs done. Another tight one from uh, from Ratnavali Balika with the RA21 without losing a wicket.
That's a good shot from uh, Kaushi Ninut Yanga. And he goes all the way for a boundary. Onto the pads that time from the bowler. And he easily put away. He's not, she's not going to miss that out. That's a brilliant strike from Kaushin Nuthyango. Onto the pads, the delivery was there to be struck. But still needed some putting as uh, there were some fielders, especially uh, towards uh, the backward square leg and the square leg fielder. And she pierced it really well. That's the end of the over six overs done. It's uh, 28 for none. Well, the bowling so far from Ratnavali, Balika Vidyale, Sandunya Mandanan for eight to Maya Ratnaikanan for 14 and Sandala Veda Singh, none for five runs. Right, so Kaushin is on strike. Oh. So it was a, a monk guarding there from the uh, bowler. Well, well, well that's, that's not something that, uh, that you see often in a, in a school cricket game, but nevertheless, it's a, it's a legit way and uh, well within the rules. So there we go, that's the first wicket. So that's good presence of mind from Nethin Vidushika to uh, dismiss the batsman, who bat the dismiss the batter who was at the non-striker's end. Shikarin Wanta, the dismissed batter.
12 of 15 for her. Well, there were a lot of confusions back in the day when uh, when this monk hiring was was introduced or rather was used in the international level. But uh, now with the rules being set, it's it's a legit way, and uh, the the batter should always stay behind the behind the popping crease until the delivery stride is over. So the bowler is well within the rules to to dismiss the batsman at the non-striker's end, and uh, that is exactly what she did. So Dulanga this Anayak is uh, the new batter. Oh, a tossed up delivery almost went through to the hands of the field at the catching. Now oh, that's a good shot there. It won't go all the way for a boundary, but still the ba the batters would collect two runs quite comfortably. In fact, they're coming back for the third run. That's good running between the wickets. Three runs. Another quick single there. So uh, six runs uh, so far in this over with one more delivery to go. That'll be a single to end the over. A successful over for uh, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale as they, they got that wicket that they've been looking for. And seven overs done. It's uh, 35 for the loss of one wicket. Seven overs done, 35 runs on the board for the loss of one wicket, chasing down a target of 200 runs, Anula Vidyale, in these finals against Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. 
Kaushani Nutyanga going strong out in the middle. 18 of 25 deliveries is the highest run scorer for Anla Vidyali in this uh, tournament so far. That's a good looking shot once again through the gap, but uh, will be just a single. Ratnavali Balika Vidyale, they have the protection in the deep. Now we are in the seventh over, that means uh, we are in the second power play. So four fielders are permitted outside the 30 yard circle. That's through the gap. Won't go all the way for a boundary. So two runs uh, taken by Dulanga Disanaika. Moves up to three with that, uh, with that couple. The record run rate almost coming down to seven runs per over, which uh, would be healthy for Anla Vidyale. Now there we go. Now that's that should be close. No, nope, nothing there from the umpire. Probably again, sliding down the leg side or maybe an inside edge. It's hard to tell from this angle. But uh, yeah, that's the decision from the umpire. Now there we go, once again, nothing from the umpire. But this is good bowling from Sandali Veera Singh. Bowling it straight, wicket to wicket. That is exactly what she's supposed to do at this stage of the game. Not giving any width outside the off stump to uh, to let Dulanga Desanayaka or Kaushini Nutyanga to free their arms. So just bowling it tight, wicket to wicket. And that is good from... Uh, from Sandali Veer Singha and that that'll be the end of the over a single taken so a four runs coming off from that over it's uh, 39 for the loss of one wicket Punch on the ground, might run away for a boundary that time. Dulanga de Sanaika as he goes all the way for a boundary. Much needed boundaries for uh, Anla Vidyale. That time, touch too short. And uh, Dulanga de Sanaika presented the full face of the bat as launched it down the ground with uh, 
mid off field in position inside the 30 yard circle it was an easy picking for the batter Now that's a good looking shot this time it's Kaushini Nutyanga and it goes all the way for a boundary. So two boundaries in this over so far with one more delivery to go so nine runs coming off from this over. Wide and a no ball. And it's going to be a free hit. Yeah, right, it's going to be a free hit uh, for Kaushani Nutyanga. Punched on the ground, it's taken, but uh, it's a free hit. And that'll be the end of the over, an eventful over that one from Netmi Vidushika. So uh, after nine overs, it's uh, 49 for the loss of one wicket. A tossed up delivery that time from Nipuni Navodhya. Dulanga Desanayaka trying to go for a big shot. See, it's not easy to play when, when the bowler is tossing the ball up. Because once the ball is coming at your eye line and it starts to dip, it's always, it's always hard to, to negotiate with that kind of a delivery or to judge... Uh, per se to uh, that kind of a delivery so it's it's one of those fine little tricks that the bowlers should uh, have in their armory but in the same time using it uh, on every delivery
might not work because by then the batter would have uh, a fair amount of judgment on whether how that ball is going to come or where it's going to land so you have to use it on crucial times to get the maximum out of that sort of a delivery Punched on the ground. That's a full toss. And it got what it deserves as a boundary. And 50 up for Anula Viviale with that boundary down the ground. 53 runs for the loss of uh, one wicket. This is a fine little partnership between Kaushini Nutyanga and Dulanga Disanayak. Uh, 20 runs between uh, these two batters. Well, it's been a fine 10 overs for Anla Vidyale, losing only one wicket so far. They're setting up a good uh, setting up a good platform for the rest of the batters to come in and to chase this target down. Well, it's a 20 more overs to go.
Kaushri Nuthyanka, 25 of 32 for her with three boundaries so far. A wide signal by the umpire. And that's the end of the over 11 overs done. It's uh, 57 for the loss of one wicket. Well, Anla Vidyale well on to the task. Almost in front of Ratnavali Balika Vidyale at this stage of the game. At the end of uh, over number 11. At this stage, as you can see, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale with 48 for the loss of two wickets. So Anla Vidyale 57 for one. With uh, two set batsmen out in the middle. With 19 more overs to go, it's, it's well poised between the two sides at the moment. But yeah, Ratnavali Balika with the Ale would be uh, would be more happy if they could get at least another one or two wickets before the end of the over, before the 20th over. At least another couple of wickets uh, would uh, set them on the right path in this uh, finals. That's a that's up in there, that's going nowhere. Oh, just over the head of the field. Uh, she was inside the 30 yard circle and uh, she's going back for the second run. The batters overthrows. See that shot was not was not played in much control. It was up in the air. And the fielder, the mid on fielder, was up in the circle. Couldn't properly uh, calculate where she should have been to take that catch. So that's how it went. Just over the head of the fielder. And a chance going down. Right, so Nipuni Navodhya bowling her second over. Now to six so far. Tossed up and that's gone. So the next delivery. Again, another tossed up delivery. Inviting the batsman down the ground to play some strokes. But Kaushiri Nuthyanga judged it very poorly and uh, the ball hit in the stumps uh, so there we go that's the second wicket and it's a set batsman it's a top run scorer for Anla Vidyal in the tournament Kaushin uh, Utyanga gone for 27 of 34 and now it's uh, two down for 59 runs on the board Imal Shiazara, she's a new uh, batter out in the middle.
Another toss up delivery. In fact, it was a free, uh, a full toss. Well, with both mid on and mid off up in the circle, it's a, it's a, it's a fair shot from the batters, but it's just about the placement and about the power and probably timing as well. You got to hit it over the head of the fielder or maybe bisect the two fielders. Right, so that'll be the end of the over. Uh, four uh, four runs and a wicket. So 12 overs done. It's uh, 61 for the loss of uh, two wickets. Down the leg side, it will be wide to start off this uh, 13th over. Dulanga is an icon, 15 of 21 deliveries, and Imal Shiazara, the new batter out in the middle, one of three. See, it's all about building partnerships and one batter coming out and playing that sort of a knock that uh, Vishmi played for Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. 125 runs was, was absolutely brilliant with the bat. So that's the kind of innings that Anla Vidyale require. Or maybe one or two good partnerships will see them through towards this target of 200 runs. So it's all about either building a partnership or maybe just like Kratnavali Balika Vidyale did just like Wishmi did with the bat they need one batter to 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 play that sort of a knock a century or maybe 80 90 runs 70 runs so that the rest of the batters can bat around that particular batsman or rather the batter so that's a kind of strategy that uh, Anula Vidyale will need to follow if they are to chase this target down, this 200 runs, 30 overs. So let's see whether they can do that. The weather, well, it's still perfect, I would say. Not immediate threat of rain, but still a bit of overcast conditions, clouds gathering. But as I mentioned earlier, there's no immediate threat of rain. So that should uh, put the mines into ease from both the sides.
So that's the end of the over. 13 overs done. It's uh, 68 for the loss of two wickets. Uh, Dulanga, this and I can are the two batters out in the middle. Kaushin in Utyanga was uh, the top scorer of the tournament. Uh, top scorers, one of the top scorers in the finals as well. And for Anla Vidyale, the top scorer, 27 Kaushini. A misfield in the deep. A misfield in the deep will allow the batters to uh, cross the ends for a single. That's up in the air. Another chance. Going in vain. And not going in the way of Ratna Ali Vidyale. Now this was what? The second or the third chance being put down. Well, they got to be sharp in the field. This is the final. It's a big game. So you would... Uh, you would want to see the fielders... Stepping up to their toes and and getting those catches, restricting those runs, saving the boundaries. But we haven't seen that so far from Ratnavali Balika Vidyali. Oh, another tossed up delivery from Nipuni Navodhya. Well, the bowling performances so far. Nipuni Navodhi amongst the wickets, 1 for 14. And the rest of the bowlers pulled well with uh, good economies, but still couldn't get into the uh, wickets column. So 14 overs done. It's 74 for the loss of two wickets, and it's time for some drinks.
Right, so fourteen overs done. It's uh, seventy-three runs on the board for the loss of two wickets at the moment. Aram is free. An absolute confusion between the two batters, but still. He passed the popping crease quite safely. There's always a bit of risk involved in such singles, so uh, the batters should be mindful about that as well, especially when you're chasing down a target like 200 runs and you're you're already two wickets down. You should always play risk-free cricket, especially at this stage of the game, especially in these middle overs. The record run with almost eight runs, in fact, more than eight runs per over, 8.15 to be exact. Slight delay of play. Right, so everything is sorted out, and uh, we're back with the ball. A misfield there. And that, in fact, they're coming back for the second run. There's a good run in between the wickets, good presence of mind from the batter to get back for the second run knowing that that fielder was uh, a tad slow and that's the end of the over 15 overs done halfway mark achieved so 77 for the loss of two wickets on Lavi Diale Now there we go, that's the wicket that they've been looking for. Dulanga Desanayaka was going uh, on really well with the bat. We'll now have to depart. That's a good delivery. Outside the off stump. And uh, just the slightest of edges taking away the wicket of uh, Dulanga Desanayaka. So 77 for the loss of three wickets now. We're in the 15th over, chasing down a target of 200 runs. 
it's going to be an interesting passage of play from from here onwards. So let's see where it leads. But at the moment, it's 77 for the loss of uh, three wickets with the longer this and I being dismissed for 18 of uh, 27 deliveries. Right, so Imasha Nethmi, she's the new bat out in the middle. Three wickets down now for 78 runs. Uh, another wicket uh, in the next couple of overs will definitely make things more interesting or more in favour of uh, Ratnavali Balika Vidyalaya. See, this is the thing about uh, when you're defending a total like 200 runs in 30 overs. You always have that advantage. You always have that advantage of having scores on the scoreboard. There's always that pressure, that scoreboard pressure that we've been talking about. The commentators always talk about this scoreboard pressure. And that is, this, is, this is exactly why scoreboard pressure is really important. So once you get one or two quick wickets in quick succession, that'll set an immense amount of pressure on the batting side because they know that they have to chase down a big target and when the wickets fall things will get more difficult for them so there is always that uh, that comfortability that advantage for the fielding side if they have that score on the scoreboard and that is exactly what we're seeing at the moment from Ratnavali Balika Vidyale and they scored 200 runs in 30 overs and now they're picking up wickets as well so 79 for the loss of three wickets in 16 overs. So there we go, that's a wicket, that's a fourth wicket. So it's 80 for the loss of four wickets now. And now all of a sudden, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale, they're back in this game. Back in this game in full time. Stumped and gone. So four wickets now for 80. Good work behind the stumps from the wicketkeeper. 
second that tossed up delivery is working fine for the Ratnavali Balika Vidyalaya. Rather than bowling it flat, the bowling tossed up, giving a bit more air to the delivery. Masan Edmi going for one or four as uh, Chamasha Bagyani, or Bagyavi rather, doing her tricks with the gloves. Hashini Linage, the skipper, 19 years of age, left-handed batter. Lots and lots and lots of responsibility on her shoulders right now. 200 runs to get, 120 runs away from the victory. Six wickets remaining. And after these three deliveries, what, 20? No, 13 overs remaining. It's anyone's game. But at the moment, I would say that Ratnavali Bali Kavidyale has the upper hand. That's a wide. Deomini Pabasera bowling her second over. One wicket already taken for just four runs. A slip in position, I like this, I like this from uh, Ratna Olivalika Vidyala. The new batter is out there in the middle, Hashan Ilyanagi. So you have to exert all the pressure that you can for the, for the new batter. And that is exactly what Ratna Olivalika Vidyala has done so far. The skipper getting in slip in position for the new batter. And some sharp fielding as well. So. It's been a good passage of play so far for Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. So 17 overs done and uh, just two runs coming off from that over. It's 81 for the loss of four wickets.
And that's no ball. So a free hit now, one offer for uh, Hashini Linagi. Wild swing once again from Imal Shiazar at that time, but uh, Lakuna Suname Kadlu Hatra and Lavidia Kandama Lakunu de Siki Laka Kamam in Sitine Imanshi Asara Samgin Hashinilin, Inaika Pandra Pardini, and Lavidia Kandam Lakuna Kasiana Makla Bagatna Ratna Vibarika Vitale Kandam, a parliament Pandra Pardimini, the Naika Vishmigunaratna, Tamange Naika Pe Wagakima Menuini Dukara, Shataka Parta Kragin to Samatuna was at Mahatan Gedi. Never said a Gana Kapasi, and Lavidia Kandam Saka. Ratna Valika with Derek and Diamond, I was on Mahatar Gaka Kidakarani Nata Lakun de Kakara, Patimar Kragano, Imashi Asara, Pondra Pardin Kidak, Domini Pabasara. I get two one Panduare Kriat Makarani. Dana Manapanduare, Avasani, Lacuna, no decay, Kadluhatra and Lavidele, Kandam, Lacuna de Sikila, Kentabat, Lacuna Cassiata Kituri, Pandu, Hetahai. Bulum Pitta 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 Navasan Mahatarangi, at the new Dessina Petuna Tunginistan is under Hapati Tarangi, Tarangin Lakunupanas Hatter Jack Labaganimeter, Radgama deo Patraj with Deli Kandam, Samatuna and Tungunastani Metangavali, Radgama deo Patraj with Deli Kandam Labaganidi, Sivunastani, Vadu Madima with Deli Kandam Labagano. Never make Kanta cricket Tarangavina, Tambalika cricket Tarangavali, pass out his Hatra Kridak. I wish a shame. Kanda Hayak, Yatate, Palamote, Taranga Pavatuna, may pass out his Hatari. On the Mapasal Dase, they went about a Santa Hasuts from Lapua, they went about a sitter, a knockout, Takarin and Pilimun, Peter Kimia, Karin Tamai Tanagavi, Kriatakuni Anu, Kanda Dase and Kanda Matak, Avasan Purvate, Avasan Purvate, Kanda Hatarak. Someone Ardazan Purate condemn Atakut, Avasan Purate condemn Hatrakut, Terry Patunahi, Avasan Pura Tarangavati, and Lavi Dele condemn a Deopatraju Dele Samaka Kridakana, Tunutarangak, Anaturu, Lakunwataka Jack Labagan Loma, and Lavi Dele, 
අවසන් මහ තරගයට සුදුසුකම් ලබන නොවේ එකම රත්නවලී වාලිකා විද්‍යාලයේ කණ්ඩායම වාද්දුව මධ්‍ය මහ විද්‍යාලයේ හමු වෙනවා ඒ තරගය ජයග්‍රහණය කරන්නේ රත්නවලී වාලිකා විද්‍යාලයේ කණ්ඩායම ඒ අනුව අනුල විද්‍යාලයේ කණ්ඩායම සහ රත්නවලී වාලිකා විද්‍යාලයේ කණ්ඩායම අවසන් මහ තරගයේ ක්‍රීඩා කරනවා ලකුණු 94යි කඩලු 4යි අනුල විද්‍යාලයේ මෙන්න පසු පාදයක සුද්ද පන්දුවක් මදුරකින ක්‍රීඩකාවගේ ඉදිරියේ පන්දුව වැටෙන්නේ විශ්මි ගුණරත්න සිටින ස්ටම්ප් කිරීමකට උත්සාහ කරන්නේ නමුත් ක්‍රීඩිකාව තමන්ගේ සීමාව සටහන් කරගෙන අවසන් විසිවන පන්දුවරේ ක්‍රියාත්මක වන්නේ තවත් ලකුණු 106ක් අවශ්‍ය තරගයේ ජයග්‍රහණය කිරීමට ඒ දිනේ සහ දෙවදසන වරුවේ ක්‍රීඩාපිටිය පැවති ආකාරයට සමගින් දිනේ තරග දෙකක් ක්‍රීඩා කිරීම සම්පූර්ණ ගෞරවයෙන් වන්නේ ක්‍රීඩාපිටි පිටිය සකසන්නන්ට නැත්නම් මේ කාර්ය මණ්ඩලයට ඒ දිනේ ඇදහැලුණු අධික වර්ෂාපතනයේ අද උදෑසන තිබුණු කාලගුණික තත්ත්වේ මේ සියලුම කාරණාවක මේ තරග දෙක මේ ආකාරයෙන් නිමා කර ගැනීමට හැකිවීම සම්පූර්ණ ඔවුන්ගේ මහන්සිය ප්‍රතිඵලය බවට පත් වී තිබෙනවා. දැන් පඳුවර් 20ක් අවසන් ලකුණු 94 කඩලු 4 යනුල විද්‍යාලයේ කණ්ඩ. लखनऊली तरंगकारी तरंग बट पत्ना तरंग इमाजी असारा पंद बी हतक दी लखनऊ दहा टाकला क्रीडा कर हाशी लेने गे लखनऊ हतर नायक आब तम अंतर दैन इलाके हम मीन सीट नवस्तावक हडवा रक्षा कर लखनऊ हम मीत मत वैद बीसी पंद वारे क्रियात्मक उमाय रत्न बात बीन अगे शिव पंद वारे क्रियात्मक कर क्रीडिकावर लकुना कारापति मारू कर गानो आइमाल सी सामग्री न हाशी नहीं यानो पास वाले लकुने के तुअन्य आनु लावी दले कांडा है मैं आवश्यक कर लेते हैं वशे निमाशा नेतमी निदेवी गोष्टी बने लकुनु एकाकला बासी थी फंदु हाथ रखे टाइम होने दी थी पास पादेर गोष्ट पंदु स्थान के तकरन उत्साह करना पॉइंट कला पे नमूद सार्थ करने पंद्रह की नं क्रीड़ कावन दे देने के लिए दवा सिद्ध नहीं स्थानी लकुनु लबाग में दावस्ता करेंगे लकुनु अनुपाय खड़ूलु हाथ रहने लगी दिले कंडाय में प्रधानाली बाली का विदेले कंडाय में लकुनु एक सियानु नामे एक लबाग तय इंटर पीले तुरुई ने मक्रीड़ा कर मिल सिटी बैकअट पॉइंट सह थर्ड मैन अतरी पंद स्थान गिरी लखनऊ दिख कट पति मार कर लखनऊ के विद्यालय खंड नायक हाशिंदेन लखनऊ दिख कट कर लखनऊ अट इधे
এবারে ড্রাইভ কিরিমা তাহলে এক লাখুনাক একচি করে গানো আনু আটবন লাখুন আনল বিদ্যালয় কান্ডায় এত সামগিন পান্দুয়ার বিসি এক কবসন লাখুন আনু আটাই খাডুলু হাতরে আনল বিদ্যালয় কান্ডায় মে লাখুন সাটহান শিকারি রানাহানসি লাখুন 12 কাটে দেবিয়ানো কাউশিনি নত্তে আঙ্গ লাখুন 27 লাবা গাতা দুলঙ্গা দিসানে এক লাখুন 18 টাই মাসি আসার আনো দেবি 19 এ ইমা শানেত মিনিক লাখুন কাটে দেবি গিয়া দেন নদেবি ক্রীড়া কর্ণ নায়কা ওহাশিন লিয়ে নেগে লাখুন 7 এ পান্দু रत्नावली बालिका विद्यालय कांडाय मत पंद्रह विषय का कबसन विनु इटे लखनऊ के सिए दोला हाई कार्डुलु खतराई अन्य विद्यालय दैन लखनऊ अनुवाट आई कार्डुलु खतराई हुंदा तारंग का कारित व्यक्त में तारंगे तुला पिटे दक्षिण लेबे नो शेष हैं मावसन पंद्रह नामे तुले रत्नावली बालिका विद्यालय कांडा� पंद्रह में वेनस आक्षेप दूर करेंगे केंद्र वाती बिना पंद्रह अनुसार विदुषी का फेरे रहा तब लखुने कसी देखा कावश्य पंद्रह अरना में आकिते नम पंद्रह पाना सात रखा डे लखुने कसी देखा नवसन महातरंगी नरबी मुट्ठ तरमाक उन्द प्रेक्षक पीरिसक पेमिनती बिर्म वड़ प्रेमी न विशिशिन्म अन्डला विद्यालिक कंडाय में पासल महातरंग पैत्वेन समेक विशिशिन्म अन्डला विद्यालिक सहा गंपहरात्ना वडी बालिका विद्यालिक कंडाय तीन एम पास हल देख मेले से आवश्यक महातरण या क्रीड़ा करना आवश्यक वित्त मात्र देगा तो नया लाखों उद्योग क्लब आगर ना वाह निपान दो टेस्ट समय के नाम लाविदे लेकर डाय में लाखों ने सीए सीमा आपस करें और लाखों ने सीए खाद लोखा तराई विश्व देवन निपान द्वारे क्रियात में कमिंति बेदी लाखों � तारमाक ये हेलिन गोवन टेम्पल से करने पांडव टेम्पल लखनऊ क्लब आगे मिटा वस्ता वक्ले बनी ने हाशी नीता नायका व दैन क्रीड़ा करने दैन क्रियात्मक वीर्य तुम्हें पितिका नहीं दे देना तब तक लखनऊ सीया का वश्य वन तारंगे जयग्रहण करी मिटा पांडव पानस एकाई केटी पांडव उठे पूल की रिमट उत्साह करना हाशिर नमूद सार्थ करने हैं तबत लखुन सी ये पांडव पान है हर ये कटम एक पांडव कटे लखुन देख बैक इंडा बागा दियो तुम्हें तारंगे जाग रहने की रिमट नाम मैं न पांडव के लिए मकड़ूले वादी मत समझें नायका वगे इन्हीं मावसन वनवा हाशिर लीने के देवी अनवा विदुषी का पीरिस के पांडव खेलिन में काटूं ले वधिन ने यानु लखुनु सी आई काट लो पहाड़ यानु विद्यालय खंडाय में दें तबत लखुनु सी अकला बागन प्रतिबेदी तबत काटूं लक कहीं मोड़ने यानु विद्यालय खंडाय में लखनऊ सी ए कार्ड लुपा है। इसी दिवन पांडव आरक्षित मकरमी सिटी ने 
नेतृत्व विदिशिका विदिशिका पेरिस लखनऊ धाना में एक टेक खाडू लाया है तुम्हें न पांडव आरे क्रेत में करने तब तक पांडव की तेरी तो वे आरक्षा कार्यों पांडव पिलिगन्नो चतुर नेतमिनी नवक क्रीडिकाव पांडुर पहाड़ी मट्ट पेमिनी लखुनात पितिकार्मिया रत्नाली बाली काव्य जल क्रीडिकावन तमत हों दिन तमान के खंडे अमर सिटे जयग्रहणीय हरवागनी में सिटी Pain ada sini pemilu pandu istana kat kerana atur pain lek kalap peta. Laku nai, imal siasa rada kulla bag. Lakunu ekasia ekai kardlu pahai wisdom guna pandu arah kreatif mak kerana umai arat naik pas guna pandu arah agi kreatif mak kerana, eta kardlu neti u nanti tamat pun de pandu arah mak, ayu sin penuh kerana misi ini. Tawat lakunu anu nama pandu lakunu anu atak lakunu atas mungkin pandu hatali sepahak kiri roti benua. Ebar pandu rakina dede nek point kalap e pandu arah gini metepai menurun amote dede na atarin pandu. देदेना में बलासी तेरी, देदेना आतर इन पांडवों का मन करने, लखनऊ देखा कि इमाल शियासा राय कट करने दी, इमाल शिया लखनऊ विशेषी मापत करें, ना देख लखनऊ विशेष का ये गेना मिलती है, पांडव तीस एक कदी, रातनावली बाली का विदेले कांडा है मी, सोयरियन देदेने क्रीड़ा करना, और देदेना � Pulut aspanduin teram hani yang neh, umai ya te. Imal sih asar ayah hari hari babi tak kelirin. Lakunu hatarak laba gitu yutu pandua. Orang power ni, wajib na pandu tili makkan, orang mud sarth kili mak neve. Brian Wimler seni Wimler suruh tu mana? Padai wedi ge, laku nak question setahan kerati. Visi tu mana pandu arah ni mau dah? Nua, laku nu ekasiya pahai, card lu pahai anlo vidyale. Kanda em, tawat laku nu anu pahai, pandu khatelis dekai, nanti pandu arah hatai.
95 runs away from victory. 42 deliveries left. Five wickets remaining. Imal Shia Zara, 21 of 34. Said batsman out of the two. He needs to get the responsibility at the moment, but uh, obviously it's 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 a lot to ask for at this stage of the game from uh, Anula Vidyale. 93 runs in 40 deliveries. And after this over, we'll only have, what, six overs remaining. So scoring 93 runs in six overs is always going to be a tough task. A oh, confusion and not a good throw from the fielder. The throw was wide and uh, the fielder, or rather the bowler had no chance there. <laughs> So there we go, that's the sixth wicket. Chatun in Ethmini trying to work that ball from the back foot. And it uh, came in straight and hit the stumps. So six down for 109 now. And Hundred and nine for the loss of six wickets now. With Chatuni being dismissed for just one run in five deliveries. So just four wickets away now. Ratnavali Balika Vidyale certainly has the upper hand in this game. Chatuni net mini one for her. Last ball of this over. A top delivery to end that over. A successful one once again for Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. Gitma Mayanti, she's the new batter out in the middle. So it's six down for 109 runs.
Can a quick single? Good running between the wickets uh, from these two batters. Over there an edge. Certainly the uh, the expressions of the bowler said so. Uh, it's been a it's been a quite horrible day for Anla Vidyala to be uh, to be precise with the ball, giving away 199 runs. In 30 overs for Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. And uh, then at the moment, six down for 112 runs in their run chase. So obviously, a lot to work on for Anla Vidyale after these finals. But still, the game is on. 87 of 31 is not impossible. It's not something that uh, that is impossible. Obviously, with four wickets down, with a set batsman like Imal Shiazara, he's on strike. With that kind of shots, it certainly is a possibility uh, for Anula Vidyale. That's a fine strike there. For a boundary, much needed boundaries. A touch too short from the bowler. And Imalshi was uh, quickly onto it. So we're now approaching the last five overs. It's 100, uh, 117 uh, for the loss of six wickets. As you can see, the first uh, five to six overs, they were comfortable on with Dali going on well. But then after that, wickets started to tumble one by one. And right after that 15th over, four wickets fell down. So inside the 10 overs from 15th to 25th over, four wickets fell. And that's where Anula Vidyale had to, uh, had to take their strategy to the back end so that's exactly what we're seeing right now with the Malcia Sara who's uh, who's the said batsman 28 a lot will depend on her presence out in the middle Now we're approaching the the last five overs of this match and with uh, six wickets down for 119 runs it's certainly uh, a game for Ratnavali College to take at this stage of the game but uh, yeah it's cricket as I mentioned earlier a lot will uh, change just they need just one good over and everything will, uh, will start to change but uh, at the moment it's not rocket science. At the moment, it's Ratnavali Balika Vidyale who has the upper hand and who will probably end up being the champion of this under-19 Division 1 tier 
or rather the under 19 division 1 girls tournament There we go, Arnla Vidyalaya was uh, up ahead in their task to uh, chase his target down. But as you as you saw in that warm graph, they started to fall apart. Especially as I mentioned earlier, that period between over number 15 to 25, they lost four wickets. And uh, not much runs came in during that period as well. And that's where things started to deplete for Arnla Vidyalaya. Right, so uh, the last four overs, 24 balls remaining and uh, 81 runs needed for Anula with Dialer. Hundred twenty two runs on the board for the loss of six wickets in twenty seven overs, eight four so far in the innings. And uh, just three more overs remaining in this game. Coming back for the second run, got to hurry. Oh, that throw was a wild throw. Went over the head of the bowler. There was a chance, to be sure. There was a chance, but... Oh, that throw was wild. Uh, there we go. That hit straight into the stumps, and that's the seventh wicket. And it's a said batsman in Malshi Azara. And all the dreams of Anula Vidyale 
will walk away off the ground with Imal Shiazara's departure. So she's gone for 33 of 48 deliveries and now it's uh, 7 down for 124 runs. Himansha Kavidi is uh, is a new batter out in the middle for uh, for Anula Vidyale. So there we go, there's the wicket, a wide not being collected properly from the wicket keeper. Not the first time that we've seen it that uh, happening today, but uh, this time the run in between the wickets was not good from these uh, two batters, Geetma Mayanti and Himasha Kavidi. So the wicket goes down, it's 8 down for 126. Senugi Vilara and the new batter. Last ball of this over. Let me with the chart three wickets for twenty eight runs. And that's another wide that time from Netmi. So that's the end of the over 28 overs done. It's uh, 129 for the loss of 8 wickets and 71 runs away from the victory on La Vigdale.
Sandali Veera Singh her bowling her fifth over. None for 12. Bowled well. Economical. Had to get into the wickets column, but uh, bowled well. Restricting uh, is her four uh, her four overs, which is 13 runs. <laughs> ah, got to hurry. Again, uh, the wicketkeeper couldn't collect the ball properly. Last ball of this over. And uh, that's the end of the over. 29 overs done. One more over to go. And uh, Anlavidyale 131. In fact, 132 for the loss of 8 wickets. Right, so the last over. So Nikesha to bowl this last over. Nikesha is quick with the bowling. And that is good to see. Quick bowler, a quick girl bowler is always uh, fascinating to see. Just uh, four balls remaining now for uh, once again a wild swing and that's gone so that's the wicket that they've been looking for that's nine down now 
for Suxus uh, for uh, Suxus for uh, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale once again. And uh, yeah, that's it. So there we go. That'll be the end of the innings as uh, Sinugi Vilara being dismissed for just one run. So victory for Ratnavali Balika Vidyale and uh, they won this. Uh, championship quite easily i would say a win by 66 runs that's a massive win that's indeed a massive win for uh, uh, ratnavali balika vidyale so handshakes all round or rather the fist bumps all round between the two teams that is good to see and uh, yeah it's been a it's been a really good performance from uh, from uh, ratnavali balika vidyale especially to uh, First of all, after batting, scoring 199 runs, being brilliant with the with the bat. One centurion in that innings as well. That set the tone for Ratnavali Balika Vidyali in this finals. And then with the ball up to their mark, restricting Anula Vidyali for just 133 for the loss of uh, nine wickets. And it's been a wonderful performance uh, from them. And... Uh, they have every right to uh, celebrate as they have been quite wonderful with uh, with the ball, with the bat and certainly in the field as well. When it mattered the most, their fielding was good. But uh, yeah, there's a lot to improve in terms of fielding. But other than that, they have been quite brilliant. And of course, Anula Vidyale coming into the finals. It's a big task. It's a big achievement. But unfortunately, there's only going to be a one winner. And uh, Anula Vidyale will be pretty disappointed with their efforts. But nevertheless, they played well throughout the tournament. They were brilliant uh, in all three departments. But uh, they fell to against uh, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale. They, they're winning this title for the first time. And uh, it's always going to be an interesting day for, they, for them, for these young budding cricketers. The under-19 division won the uh, girls' tournament. So there we go, Anula Vidyale. The batting looks. Uh, that's a horrendous looking uh, batting lineup or a sort of a batting card. Imal Chiasara, 33 of 48, the highest run scorer. And Kaushini Nutyangana. Nutyanga, 27 of 34 for her. So 133 for the loss of 9 wickets in 29.3 overs. With the ball, they were quite brilliant. Netmi Vidushika, 3 wickets for 30 runs. And Nipuni Navod, they're picking up 2 wickets for 20 runs. Devuni Papasara, 1 for 30. Nikesha Kavindi, 1. So that's how it went for Ratnavali Balika Vidyali. They were brilliant with the ball. Right from the start, they picked up those wickets. And especially, as I mentioned, uh, quite a few times that uh, period from over number 15 to 25, they certainly took the, took the game towards, uh, towards their hand, towards their advantage. And that is where the game started to change in the favor of Ratnavali Balika Vidyali. So the partnerships, well, 29 and 30 runs for the first two wickets. The only notable partnerships in the in the innings, but then again, look at that. No, from over number 15 to over number 20, four wickets fell, and not a lot of runs came in that period as well. So that's where things started to fall for Anula Vidyale, and certainly they will look back at it and will try to uh, recorrect what they uh, did wrong in that time period uh, to uh, obviously to have that advantage in the in the next edition or in the next uh, years uh, or the 2021-22 tournament as well so there we go 133 for the loss of nine wickets in 29.3 overs it's been a wonderful day of cricket earlier we had the third place uh, match and now the finals as Ratnavali Balika Vidyale winning by a decent margin look at that Anula Vidyale was on top at the start up until that 10th over but after that even up until the 15th over but then from 15th over to 25th over look at the drastic change so that's where things started to change for uh, Anula Vidyale. Now, the match summary. Well, Ratnavali Balika Vidyale batting first scored 199 runs. Vishmi Gunarat, the top scorer, 125 runs of 92 diluted. was brilliant with the ball. Sandali Veera Singh, 31 of 39. And Netmi Vidyashika, 16 of 17 deliveries. And with the ball, Imal Shiyasara, 2 wickets for 43. Himasha Kavindi, 1 wicket for 25. And uh, Anula Vidyale, in reply, were restricted for 133 or... Uh, for the loss of nine wickets in 39.3 overs with uh, Imal Shiasara, 33 of 48, 
Hausini Nutyanga now 27 of 34 and Netmi Vidushka with the ball 3 for 30. Nebuni Navo there 2 for 20 and Devuni Pabrizara one wicket which is 13 runs. So Ratnavali won by 66 runs and they won the championship quite easily beating uh, Anula Vidyale by a decent margin or by 66 runs. That's not decent, that's a big win. That's a big win that they'll remember for years to come. And uh, it's, been a, it's been a brilliant effort from these girls from uh, Gampaha. Right, so we'll take a short break and uh, we'll be back with the presentation ceremony of the Zander 19 Division 1 uh, Girls Tournament 2020-21. So uh, until that, stay tuned with uh, thebatsman.com.
Lanka, Pasal Cricket Sangame, Sangha Nicot Laban Vaisa Rudhan in Pahala, Kanta Cricket Tarangavali, Sri Lanka Cricket Sampurna, Anugraha Sentam, Tarangavali, Sangha Nicot Navasan Mahatar and Gay Bloomfield Frida Pitti, Pavetuna, Mugegodan La Vidale, Kanda Masaha, Gamparat Navali Valka Vidale, Kanda Matrai, May Tarange, Pavetuni, Tin Tarange. Jagan at Ratna Libalika with the Kandam Samatuna, Ian were Mevasa Shuri in Shuri and Bot Patwani, Gampa Harat now Libalka with the Kandam. In a summon for the not third episode, Sudanamani, Isanda Hamat Samagin, Saman the Veneva, Sri Lanka Passel Cricket Sangamega to Sabatuman, Eva Gamalan the Vidal Vidu Helpati, Tilakwatia Metuman, Eva Gamer, Sri Lanka Cricket Athene, Kanta Cricket, Kendum Karni, Absar Tilakrat Metini, Eva Gamer, Sri Lanka Passel Cricket Sangami. Group Sapatini Saharat Navali Balka with the Levi do her patinivas in Katu to Gana, Hema Java than Mahatmi, Eva Gamma, Sri Lanka Passel Cricket Sangami, Garulekam to Lekam Tuma, JK's Indrajit Mata, Eva Gamma, Member Vice Rudan in Palataranga will Lekam Tuma, Nishant Kumar Mata Saha, Anla Vidale, Frida Bar Upper Vidu her patini, HH Sri and Mahatmi. Api Mulimimane Anushurian Wukanda met a Sahatik Padbeda di Matama, Sandaha, Gaurin to Aradana Karnava. Uh, Ratna Valibarika Vidale, Vidur Patini, Vagam Sri Lanka, Passel Cricket Sangami, Upasaba Patini, Hema Java than a Matmit, uh, at a Sahedi Masandaha, JK Silijit Mahatat, Sri Lanka, Passel Cricket Sangami, Lekam Tumat. Muliman Lavi de Kandam Sadaha Satik Badbeda Dima Naikava. Hashini Lien again Shikari Nuanta Kaushini Nutyanga Netmi Tarusha Imasha Netmini Sama Dinit Mini Enu Di Pereira Senugi Guru Singh Dulanga Disanaika H. Ella Yasara Chatuni Nit Mini Himasha Kavindi Pereira Gitma Mayanti Pasatma Metuli Anumi Vidunya Chanumiti Sama Shakya Binguni Oshadi Jivanti Sarasi Randima Eva Gamer Anla Vidyale Cricket Bar Achar Tuman DS Summer Vikram Matuman Tat Garden to Aradana Karsitna Eva Gamer Anla Vidyale Pradana Puhunukaru Dinesh Vir Singh Matata Saha Sahai Punukaru, Lalangara Japakshamata at Garden to Aradana Kerma Behisiti Antonova, Oba de Pelata, Milangata Ratna Valibalika Vidale condemns Santa Ha Sati, but Bedadi Mesa and the Hamagarun to Aradana Kersitnova, Andla Vidale, Krida Bar, Neoji with Hulpatini, Echetri and Mahatmeter, at Sahim Santa Ha, Nishant Kumar Mahatata, Mivara Tarangavali. Vice Rudana in Pala, Silumat Tarangavale Likam Tuman Ratna Valibalika with the Limber, Shurian Batapatu Kandam, Netmi Gunaratna Vidushika Pereira Asmita Rasanjali.
Kasundi Kulatunga Deumini Pabasara Umaya Hemini Ratnaika Hasini Himaya Anjali Pratiba Sandali Veera Singh Chamasha Idri Singh Sanduni Amanda Supipi Premakanta Nikesha Vijay Sekar Kavya Purnima Malisha Madushani Nipudi Navodya Jai Singh Vihangi Kavindya Gunasingh Naikav Saha Shatakalabi Vishmi Gunaratna Evage Maratna Ali Balika Vidyale Cricket Bar Acharni Anusha Gunasekar Metini Atat Evage Pradhan Puhunukaru Gayan Munasingh Mahata Atat Saha Sahaya Puhun Karu Aruna Gunarat Namahatada Bevin Sudantino Bedepelata Milangata, Member Tarangavili Santaha, Sri Lanka Cricket Titan, Missin Labadina, Mudal Tiaka Pitney Mimitai, Sudanavani Santa Hama Gauruni to Aradana Krishna, Sri Lanka Cricket Titan, Kanta Cricket Kedum Karni, Apsari, Tilakrat Nemetinita Saha. Eva game Sri Lanka pass at cricket Sangi Megar Sabapati Nalanda Vidal with her Petuman Tilakwati Amata Mulinme Anushurta Vedimu Anula Vidale Kanda Naika Tara than Akrasitna Laksha de Kamarkin with Mudal Tiage, with the Labagan Sri Lanka cricket titan, if you see Mirtanga Vilita Labadini. Vagema Vasara Hai Katapasu, Shuratave, Namavinas current to Samatuna, Gampaha, Ratna Vilibalika Vidale Kandam Naikata Governor in Ara the Nakano, Lakshatunaka, Mudal Tage, Labagan Milangata Pusalana Pradani uh Esandahama Garuni to Aradana Krasitna uh Sri Lanka Pass at Cricket Sangame Lekam Tumata, Ivagima Upa Sabapeti Tumianta, Saha Taranga will come to Mat Saha, uh Handla Vidali Krida Barani Uji with Pat Tumata. Mevara Pasugi Vasare Tumunastani Sandha Peti Tarangeta my Surta with Sandha Pavatuni and La Vidale Kanda Mevara Anu Surata Vidanagan to Samatana, the Das Visi de Kavasa Rudan and Pahala. Kanta netam balika cricket tanaga vali anu surta ve anla vidyale kanta mihi mikaragano. Avasan avasen wasera haya pura vate radga madeva patraj vidyale taman satu karagani mitibu surta ve. Mever, the Das Visi de Cavasari, Taman Satukaraganata, Gampa, Rata Vali Balka with Elekandam Samatanova, Vishmikuratara, the Nakarsitnova, a Pusalani, Labaganimeter
तेन दिदास मिसी देख वाइस आउट उद्धान में पहले कांता क्रिकेट तरंगावली ब्लूमफिकर ब्लूमफिकर क्रिकेट पीड़ा पीड़ी में आकारे नदी ने आवश्यक महातारंग के पीड़ा क्रिमिन समाप्त हो नो रत्नावली बाल का विद्यालय खंडे में शुरुआत आवेदन नगर में निवागे मनुगे को डांडला विद्यालय खंडे में अनुशुरुआत आवेदन नगर में